Hey, welcome Jeff Hagee Daily Success Strategies. Thanks for being with me today. Hope you're having a great day and I hope you had a chance to listen to my episode yesterday. We talked about goals and going back and reflecting on previous goals you've had because when you do that, you'll realize that some of the things you're actually doing right now, you're living some of the things that used to just be goals and dreams to you. And it's good to reflect on that and appreciate the things that you have accomplished and help let that help to build your momentum, build your confidence and everything you're doing. What I want to do is talk more about that list that I had that I was reflecting on yesterday. It was a list of goals, 120 something on there that I had that I made in February of 2004. So the reason I had that list now, first of all, if, if you're trying to set your goals, you're wanting to know where you're going to go in life, those sort of things. Number one, go to jeffhagey.com, get my free momentum training and go through that process. So you can do the future pacing, you can figure out your path and you can figure out your why behind all your goals. But I also want you to go, I want you to go through this practice as well, because there's a lot of value in it. It's a practice that I learned back in 2004 from Mark Victor Hansen. And what I want you to do, find yourself a quiet place and get a piece of paper. And I want you to clear your mind. I want you to have no limitations nothing's off limits and I just want you to start writing. I want you to start writing and come up with at least 101 goals, wishes, dreams that you want to accomplish. You know, if you want to accomplish something, you first got to know what it is. And so start writing these things down. And like I said, don't limit yourself. Don't be afraid to write down things that right now you might think are impossible. You know, we've often talked about your reticular activating system, your RAS you've got to identify these things before it's ever possible that you can achieve them. And then once you've got this list, go through it and start saying, I want to do this in a year. I want to do this in five years, 10 years, whatever it is, put a time limit on it and it'll help you kind of start organizing them. And if you don't achieve it in that time limit, it's fine. You know, that list I went through yesterday, I made it in 2004. Some of those goals that I've just recently achieved, I had, dates a long time ago, but it took me 10, 15 years to achieve them. But the biggest thing is to get inventive and write 101 or more goals. So do that. And I would love to have you email me a copy, jeff at jeffhagey.com. In a year, I'm going to email it back to you and we can talk about it and see what goals you've been able to knock off that list. So clear your minds, have no limitations as you do this. But go out and make a list of at least 101 goals, wishes, and dreams that you want to achieve. Everything from places you want to go, people you want to meet, things you want to accomplish, the amount of money. Be specific. Don't just say, I want to make more money. How much more money are you going to make? How much money are you going to make? How are you going to make it? Be very specific on the things you want. What is the new car you want? What's the new car? What is it? What year is it? What make is it? All those things. Be very specific. But spend at least an hour doing this, more if you have to. But be very specific and at least a minimum of 101 goals. So hopefully you can have a great time doing this. You're going to achieve a lot of these goals. And a lot of them you will achieve very quickly. So love to hear about it as you're doing this. Send me a copy, jeff at jeffhagey.com. But thank you again for listening and we will talk to you again tomorrow. See ya.